I ordered the Huda palette, the uh, Desert Dusk palette. I saw a lot of you on Instagram that you had gotten it, and I was I was inspired to go ahead and spend the money. This, in case you haven't seen it, that's what it looks like. It's it's a beautiful palette. Um, the picture on the front is gorgeous. The colors are beautiful, and uh, this is the look I did with it. If you don't like the look, just go ahead and click away now. All right, let's start on the eyes. I'm using the Dolce & Gabbana Perfect Mono Eye Color in Nude to give myself a nice clean canvas. I'm going to put it on the top and the bottom. I'm going to go in with the lightest color in the Huda, the new Huda palette, and it's called Desert Sand. And I'm going to use this big fluffy brush. Then I'm going to take the color Eden, which is this peach, right here. I'm going to put that in the crease. I'm using the same fluffy brush. This is a random, no-name brand brush that I acquired along the way. Uh, if you want one, Leave it in the comments and I'll get you one. I think there's a limited number of them left. All right, there is the Eden in the crease. Now I'm gonna darken the, the corners some. And I'm going to use the Sigma E45 brush. It's a pointed and it's very soft. And I'm going to use Oud. It's a brown and it's in the corner here. Uh, these shadows are as pigmented as you would have, as you would expect from Huda. Continuing to put the oud in the outer corner. That's what we have so far. Highly, these duochrome ones, and I'm going in with Twilight. It's kind of a, a lavender. I'm gonna take a flat concealer brush, and I'm taking this Makeup Forever Aqua Seal, and I'm gonna wet my brush with it and then wipe it off a little bit and go in with this. And I'm gonna tap this on my lid. I'm using the Mario Badescu uh, Rose Water Spray 
facial spray to wet my brush and I'm dipping into the into the twilight and patting it on my on my lid on just the moving lid and concentrating it along the lash line all right let's do the other one Okay, the secret to the, the duochrome is you need to put it on with your, press it on with the finger. Nefertiti, and I'm going to press that in the center. This is a Morphe brush and M168. I'm going to work on the bottom lash line. First, I'm going to take the Eden that I used on the top. and run that along the bottom. Then I'm going to take the Oud again and run that along the bottom and bring it dark re work on that outer at outer corner again. Okay, there's the oud on the outer corner. To the twilight. And I'm gonna put it in the I'm gonna put it in the center. I'm going to take a uh, pencil by Urban Decay. It's called Psychedelic Sister. I'm going to put that in my waterline. Next, I'm going to take my uh, Tom Ford eye defining pen in deep and I'm going to do a baby wing on top.
There's one. Okay, there's, there's the baby wings. Let's do some quick brows. I'm still using the Tanya Crooks Brow Gal. There's one. Oh no, brow. I'm going to work on the front a little bit. Need a little, little extra help with a magnifying mirror. There we go. Let's, let's darken these tails. Okay, now that we've got the brows on, we can see a little more what we need to do with uh, the rest of the look. And I'm gonna go off camera and put my eyelashes on. So I have my lashes on. So I have my lashes on now. Let's do some, um, and I use the Christian Louboutin mascara. It's back in its pretty little. I'm gonna use the NYX bronzing and contour kit. I'm gonna use the pinker shades in it. I noticed that all my bronzing and contouring products that I own have been a little orange lately. And this one is is pinker. Is cooler. Whichever whichever helps you do a picture in your head of what I'm talking about. There you go. Contour the nose. I'm brushing up the side, across the top. Let's put on some Cabana Boy by The Balm. I'm going to use my mop brush. It's a Hobby Lobby brush. If you have any questions, if you have any questions about this brush, leave it in the comments. And I'll tell you specifically which one it is if I forget to put it in the uh, box below. Um, let's put some, this is the Casey Holmes Spotlight Palette, the collab she did with Stila. I'm going to take this, uh, another brush from the Hobby Lobby, and I'm going to take the pinker one in this and run that on the outside 
when I put on my foundation, I use the Pop Face Magnet and the Makeup Forever HD Foundation. And it's uh, Y335. It's the N127. That's how old it is. Moisturizer on my lips is the Clinician's Complex. Um, just to get them softened up a little bit before I try to put some lip product on. Today I'm going to wear, um, I went through my lipsticks and I found some that I used to really, really like. Um, I cut them off and put them in my kit in a, a MAC palette. Anyway, this is Laura Merce, this is Laura Mercier, 60's pink, and I'm going to put that, I'm going to put that on. I would say that I like this as, as much as the, Mac Cream Cut. I'm going to take a little, uh, did I say steal it? It's a Smashbox Casey Holmes collab. I'm going to put a little of the white one on the end of my nose and between my eyes. I'm going to touch up the Celestial that's in the, on the tear duct. This is the look. I'll come in 